And now I can't see what weapon I have because I'm in the safe zone. High branch, good. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and nap because I'm scared to. Do no, you know what? Let's run around and do some stuff at night and see what happens. I'll stay right close to this fence. This dumb zombie? Hey, die! Why are you wearing a bathing suit? <laughs> Seriously, why are you wearing a bathing suit? You're dead. And you're wearing a bathing suit too with a little beach skirt thing on. Or is this underwear? Are you all in your underwear? Yeah, you've got at least kind of a dress. I'm not real sure this is the way they dress in Huron, but, uh, You know, I really should have been using this weapon earlier. You... You also shall die. I mean, you can't really die because you're already dead, but you also will die... again. It's like the second death. Biblical reference! <laughs> but you don't get a lot of those playing video games, do you? Uh... It doesn't seem... Oh, here's an interest. No, they're not over there. Also, topless. <laughs> Not topless, but, you know, dress topless. That's some plastic. PVC tubing. What do we make out of PVC tubing, anyway? We're gonna be outdoors when the sun comes up. That's our goal. Disgusting. <coughs> oh, wow! Hell. I have never before in the history of this game. Alright, what do we get? Unnoticed. Is that all? I thought I was supposed to get a little. Oh, you have to. Be discovered and then escape to get the agility points. Forgot about that. <laughs> now, so we're still agility pointless. Airdrop stolen. It wasn't so much stolen as I ignored it, actually. Let's see about this whole thing. Oh, run around in the sewers where there's gates that prevent you from getting anywhere. What the heck is over there? I'm working on it. Would you just back off? I'm not keen on messing with those guys, weak as I am right now. I made this sort of a vague goal that I may or may not stick with to get as far in the main quest as possible before starting to do side quests because a lot of the stuff in the main quest just doesn't really require all that much power. And then I'll have all this left over time and a lot more open area to just play around with. So we'll see. It might be fun to kill some zombies here. Though. This is the way it is. Hit each one of them four times. One, two, three, four. Are you dead? Yep, you're dead. Works, works. One, two, three, four. Dead? Indeed. 
That's interesting. I used to think that hitting them in the head was the thing to do, but I think they just take however many poundings. I don't know. Looks like they may just take however many poundings that your power level dictates with your weapon. Way, way more powerful than previous ones. Oh, my weapon's doomed. That's why. I bet you no. Nope. Yeah. See, and then when you hit their break point, they like die no matter where you hit them. That's my new working theory. Skills. Power. More hit points. Kick stun. Your kick has a 10% chance to stun the enemy. Or multi throw. Ooh. Yeah, because I haven't been using that. Okay, so in order to do this, we actually need to go ahead and make some missile weapons, and since these are the only ones that we can make right now, we shall make them. How many of them do we have? We have five. <laughs> well, that's not gonna take long. Oh boy. Nice thing about it is it looks like there's just not very many zombies around. Right? Okay, Raheem, I'm here. Make sure they see you and know who you are. You don't want to sneak up on them. That's a good way to catch a bullet. Wish me luck, kid. Good luck, brother. You're going to need it. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Hands up! What the fuck do you want? I'm here to see Rice. Brecken sent me. Brecken? That asshole on the tower? All right. What does he want? I've come to make a deal. What kind of deal? The kind I make with Rice, not with his flunkies. All right. Let him through. This ought to be entertaining. Should indeed. How long have we been friends, Osman? We have been friends for a very long time. That is why I'm so surprised that you would steal from me. Haven't I seen you somewhere before? Now I give you a choice. On the news. Very simple. Your right Punk. hand or your left. <laughs> left. <laughs> Was that my left or your left? And by this, we are meant to understand that Rice is not a very nice person. You have the look of the tower about you. What do you want? I'm here to make a deal. A deal. Fantasy, no doubt. Desperate times. And what do you offer in return? Hmm? Your services? Your loyalty? Perhaps I should take both. Talk to Karim. He's one of ours. Do what he asks of you, and Rise will consider giving your people some antazim. Understood? I don't seem to have a choice. Perceptive. There's that hand. Helping hand. Rusty reed knife. I wonder if that's actually any good. What a scavenger I am. Rusty reed knife. No, it's not. Might be worth some money, though. I do need to get back somewhere. 28. 28. 
39. Why is this pipe wrench so much better than every other pipe wrench I've ever had? Did I? I didn't amp it up, did I? I didn't see any plus sign there. That's strange. Best pipe wrench ever. Okay, let's go talk to Goober over here. Get inside. I met Rice, and Jade's right. He's a psychopath. He's also the GRE's rogue operative. Now I've got to cooperate with this piece of shit. Not only because of my mission, but also because he's got a ton of antizen stockpiled. Yeah, yeah. So that little picture you saw way back at the beginning of the video, that's how you supposedly know that's him. Tower trash. Tower trash. Aren't you a sweetheart? guy over here that I can sell stuff to? I don't want to talk to you just yet. You! Buy all my crap. Buy it now! Buy it now! That's the good pipe wrench. That's a gas pipe that I forgot I had. <laughs> Rusty Reed knife's worth a lot of money despite being crappy. Wait a minute, it says 40. Okay, maybe I'll keep it. I'll keep that safe. 40, 30, 93. Oh, yeah, that's way better than anything else I have. So we'll sell that, and 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 that. And I have 400 whole dollars, which allows me to buy precisely jack diddly crap. Really should get out there and fight a little bit. <laughs> okay, we'll we'll fight a little bit more. You, what do you want, Kareem? There you are. Rice said you'd be coming by. I'm Kareem. Crane. An American. I have an uncle there. Lives in Texas. You from Texas? You a cowboy? I'm from Chicago. Okay, Al Capone. We'll be in constant contact over the radio. That way I can make sure you get where you need to go. And where's that exactly? You're going to be climbing antenna towers and switching on shortwave radio modulators. Most of my men are too slow, too fat, or too drunk to climb a tower like that without killing themselves. If I do this, I'll get the answers in? That's between you and Rice. I know better than to speak for him. Just don't fail. He doesn't handle disappointment very well. That guy seriously has some serious bags under his eyes. Oh, go contact the GRE again. Okay, whatever. Hey, uh, where am I? Is this it? No, it's right here. Just met a guy named Kareem. He's like Rice's major domo, I guess. Or number one flunky at the very least. Kareem's sending me to fix some antennas for Rice. Nothing better than being an errand boy. Nothing better. Nothing. Uh, here. Climb yet another random building. <sighs> a way to get a lot of combat experience. Stand up here. I don't have my... Oh, how? Oh, no. This is... Horrible bug. Horrible, horrible bug. Whereby... Oh, I know. Oh, please be this case. No, it's not letting me. But I don't have it. Oh, that's fine. Okay. The reed knife in your hand, idiot. Now then. Ah. This is probably an even better place to stand and kill things. Can I reach you? I can indeed. Come on over. Get some energy and then beat the crap out of people. 